Good morning. It's day two of the fast. I don't know about you, but I'm not that excited about it yet. Uh, but I'm going to make it. I've got some words of encouragement for you today. Uh, if you're like me, you're getting hungry right about now. And uh, this day two, you're thinking, why in the world am I fasting? What have I done? Uh, we talked about it yesterday. Listen, if Jesus could have accomplished everything without fasting, then why didn't he? But he chose to fast. He modeled it in front of us. And so for us, we need to follow on that. So I want to encourage you to keep going. I have a passage of scripture I just want to bring to you this morning, uh, hopefully to encourage you. And uh, John chapter 6, verse 35, Jesus talking here, he tells the people around him and the disciples, he makes this declaration and he says, I am the bread of life and he who comes to me will never go hungry and he who believes in me will never be thirsty. One thing we have to remember today is that back then when Jesus spoke these words that bread was the main ingredient in their diet. Every single day they had bread. It's not like today where uh, we can go without bread and it's just a side dish or it comes before our, our main entree and we could have bread or do without it. Back then, daily bread was the main ingredient. And so when Jesus told them this, it took them back because basically what he was saying is, you need me every day. Regardless of where you're at, you need me every single day. If you'll come and you'll follow me, you'll never go hungry and you'll never thirst again. I will give you everything that you need. And that's exactly what, what God wants to do during this fast for me and for you. And the great thing about fasting is it does make you hungry. You, you do uh, value food a little bit more, but fasting will also make you hungry for the things of God. Fasting will also increase your desire to see the things of God produced in your life and in your family. And so I pray, my prayer for you today is that you will truly see this fasting as uh, getting closer to God and knowing that if we continue to fast, continue to believe in God, that he is everything that we need. And even though physically we may be hungry and may be thirsty and may want a cheeseburger, God wants to totally satisfy us, not just physically, but spiritually, so that we are, he, he truly is the bread of life in us daily, and it's all that we'll ever need. God bless you, and I'll see you tomorrow.